we present a novel method for authoring desert landscapes, allowing to easily reproduce the variety of features typically found in deserts. Arid landscapes cover about 25% of Earth landmass, yet they have received little attention in computer graphics. Wind and sand transport are the main processes that shape the various desert features, such as transverse dunes, barken dunes, or star dunes. The main contributions of this paper are 1. An interactive aeolian erosion simulation, combining a set of stochastic sand transportation rules operating on a layered terrain model. 2. A procedural model for approximating the wind flow over the relief of the terrain. And 3. A controllable wind model for authoring deserts' landscapes. We use a layered model of the terrain representing bedrock, sand, and vegetation. At the heart of our method is a procedural model for the surface wind, accounting for the terrain relief. A sand transport algorithm, modeling the different processes that create dunes. And the abrasion of bedrock due to the sand transport. Users can specify an overall wind regime, as well as directly manipulate wind direction, at any time. This high-altitude wind field is warped taking into account the terrain relief, in order to compute the wind field at the surface. We also take into account wind shadowing effects, which is fundamental for the formation of dunes. Surface wind can lift sand slabs and transport it to other locations, a transport mechanism known as saltation. From this new location, the sand slab might bounce or deposit on top. Bounces and depositions can also displace sand to nearby cells, a movement known as reptation. Finally, the slope is too steep, sand can avalanche to a stable position. When bedrock is hit by sand slabs bouncing, abrasion takes away material from it and creates features like yardongs. Next we show some videos rendered from interactive editing sessions and depicting the formation of different features. Transverse dunes are created under unimodal wind regimes and medium to high sand supplies. Barchins are crescent-shaped dunes also formed with unimodal winds at high speed when the sand supply is low. Climbing dunes appear on the windward side of cliffs and big terrain obstacles. Similarly, Nabka dunes form around vegetation and protect it by blocking the transport of sand. In this example, wind speed is linearly increased over time to create multi-scale dunes. When sand hits the bedrock, abrasion creates elongated features, known as yardongs.